Hello and thanks for watching this Cloud9 ERP Solutions video and subscribing to our YouTube channel. In this series of videos of Acumatica 2023 R1, Acumatica has added an archive documents function. And what this allows you to do for sales orders and shipments, this allows you to take out documents that you don't need to search for. So they're still there when you archive them. You can get to them and I'll show you how. But this gives you the ability to clean up the system so that you're not searching through old records. So pretty straightforward. You check off the dates that you'd like to archive. Click process. You can schedule this, click the add button and schedule this and put a filter date. So right now, for example, I can create a scheduler. I can go and say when I want to schedule. I recommend doing this at night because it'll hog a lot of resource and slow the system down. But you can say, you know, tonight at 8 p.m. or 10 p.m. And then under conditions, you can see Acumatica's, you can see the schedulers pick the dates that I checked, but instead you can say, right at an archive date, and you could pick greater than or less than or between a certain date range. Additionally, Acumatica's also added the archiving process duration. So what this means is that if it's gonna take longer than a certain period of time, then Acumatica will stop and wait till the next time it runs it. Additionally, Acumatica's added a side panel here. So based on the date you're selecting over here, it can show you what's been done. So if we select a specific date, click the process button. Notice it's 245 documents. As I mentioned before, this will take some time to run. So I'll pause and we'll come back as soon as it's done. And actually that didn't take too long. You can see here it was 25 seconds elapsed. But if we click close, you can go into archive history as well. So that's that screen that was part of the side panel. So you can see the two different times we've done it and what date ranges we were archiving. There's the 245 documents we just did. And then it came up at the beginning. So now how do I see these now that they've been archived? Well, there's two ways. If you take a look at generic inquiries, a lot of videos to show you how to work with generic inquiries and how to create your own. But you'll notice there's a checkbox here, show archived records. By default, it's not checked. So if you wanted to, you can create a generic inquiry for sales orders or shipments. And you can check off show archives and actually do a lookup and find those. Additionally, in the report designer, Acumatica also has a property for archive records. So if you're building any kind of output report and you want that report to include archive records, you simply select the print option. You also have hide or only show archive records. But this is the property that you would change in order to see that in the form based reports from the report designer. So that's it. That's archive records. Acumatica has added it to sales orders and shipments. And I suspect other areas of Acumatica will also be eligible to be archived as well. So hopefully you found this video useful. Please click the like button if you did. And thanks so much for watching. And if you have any questions about this or anything else Acumatica, feel free to reach out to us. We'd love to hear from you. Thanks again and have a great day.